Hey guys, welcome to today's video, which is a mini home sense haul. Mini for me. <laughs> I go in there and get completely carried away I actually went back for a specific blanket that I've been in love with that's like cream and it has pumpkins on it I think I was too late everyone that's posted like that has it from this year went in like July or the very beginning of August I wasn't even thinking about autumn at that point um so I was too late I was I was way too late so just so you know if there's stuff you really want the start of August is the time to go. It's annoying. I wish it, they'd delay it and so we could enjoy, you know, the moment we're in and let summer be over and then start with autumn. but it is the way it is. So I didn't get that. And there was actually a lot less stuff this time. Like when I went in the first time and there's a giant haul, which you should have seen, um, that I did. And I did a shop with me video, which I will link at the end of this video. Um, when I went then, there was like, three whole aisles of just autumn candles and the end things were all autumn candles as you went in it was just like four things of autumn mugs and cups then there was like four aisles of all halloweeny stuff and then the whole back was all autumn and winter and uh, halloweeny um like cushions and blankets this time when i went back it had all been condensed to like just a few aisles near the front and the rest had all just gone back to like furniture and other random stuff so there wasn't as much stuff but still some very good stuff and i was a very good girl because i knew how much i got recently <laughs> i put a lot of stuff back because i just go in there and i'm like yes i love it all but actually I'm starting to like really have to think, okay, but where will you actually put that in your house? Like how we use it? Like, oh, there were these amazing candle holders. They like obviously hold little tea lights, but they were like glass and so heavy, but they were 20 quid each. And they had like pastel glass, three like skulls piled up all looking different directions. And then a candle holder. I was in love. And I was immediately like, that can go on the dining room table. But I'd already like picked a theme and a colour and the way I'm going to do the dining room. And they actually wouldn't make sense. So I, it broke my heart, but I put them back. Anyway, let's get into this haul. First thing, I'm sorry, this is so adorable and it's going to look so cute in our living room. This little mushroom. I love it so much. <laughs> it's like sparkly on top. It's very light. It was 5 dollars um, it's got all the mossy stuff down here. I just know on a shelf or in our fireplace or something that is just gonna look adorable I love it next. I got this pillow um, And I got this because it's gonna very much go with our other pillows. I've already got I was very selective um, And I don't like a lot of the stuff is obviously very dark and like a lot of stuff's black and color and I just don't have those, that color or that like scheme in my house, so I needed lighter color stuff and I actually like this and I like the texture, I like the orange around the edges. This was, they only had two of them and only one had a tag on it, 14.99. Uh, but it will go with ones we've already got and ones I got this year, so. Whether I put that on the sofa or in our bed, like it will, or on the spare bed, it'll make sense anywhere. I got these and I'm very excited about it because autumn is my time to get back into one of my biggest passions in life, baking. And so, look how cute this is oh my goodness it's a little halloween cupcake set i love merry merry and i was there was some merry merry stuff in the last haul from there this was 6.99 comes with little the little cupcake um cases but also all these little things you can stick in top <laughs> i'm gonna do a whole autumn baking video if you want to see that definitely let me know and i can like include some of my favorite recipes and make it halloweeny which will be very very cute this is one of the things i'm most obsessed with and i ummed and odd because i did have the like where am i gonna put it debate in my head but ultimately what i obviously i could use it just as a bowl for like candy uh to give out on halloween or you could use it for many many things i think i would like to put a plant in it um i just adored it this is what I'm going for this year. This is my vibe for the autumn stuff. Like a lot of cream because it just suits this house. And then like the the paler, like pastely oranges, it's all speckled inside. It's huge. It's 14.99. It's proper ceramic. It's it's just lovely. I love it so much. And to go with that, I just think that with a plant coming out of it 
like on the table or in here somewhere. I think might, might even put it up there would look amazing. And to go with that, and I, my, I am denied more about this than about that. Cause I was like that ultimately I could put on the floor in the corner of a room with a plant in it. I could put on a windowsill, I could put on a shelf, I could put it wherever. This though, I was like, hmm. I immediately wanted to put like three little candles, like three little pumpkin candles that I got in the last haul on it and I was like that will be adorable but also like if I bake this would be lovely to like present stuff on if we have if we host and have people around be lovely to put food on um I just obviously love this range of stuff <laughs> and actually when I went to the till with it the ladies at the till were saying that like they really love it and everyone really loves it um this was 9.99 and it's like just a little serving tray really but I thought in the middle of the table like I got a pumpkin table runner down the middle of the table and I thought that in the middle with some little pumpkin candles would just look adorable I really like it I mean it's got lots of uses and also like I think what I need to get in my head as well is that like I don't have to always every single year put everything I've got out at this time of year like I can same Christmas like last Christmas was the, genuinely the first Christmas that instead of just putting everything out I was really like, I'm not as into that this year, so I'm gonna leave that in its box and not feel bad about it and not feel weird about it and just, it's okay. And I might be back into it next year. And if I'm not, then I can sort of donate it or whatever. But my mum does that, like she cycles through her stuff. Like she won't always have the same exact stuff out every Christmas, but I seem to do that. And like, I don't need to do that. So if this is more my vibe this year and some of the stuff I've already got isn't, then I don't need to put everything out and I can choose this, you know? And um, yeah, I just, I really like it. And actually moving to this house has changed a lot of stuff because it's it's very old cottage. Um, I don't think, it's not technically a cottage. I just call it, we just call it our cottage because it's very cottage vibes. Like it looks like a cottage. We've got the big uh, beams. Um, it just, yeah, we're in the middle of the countryside. <laughs> very old style like the tile the tile and the roofs it's all just very it just it looks like a cottage but i don't think it's technically a cottage but it's very old it's a very old house it's from like 1890 to 1910 they sort of guessed it was like built um and i don't know it just suits different stuff which my mum told me would happen when we moved here uh i was already like buying stuff for this house and she was like hold off because what you like now when you're in the, this house you might like completely stuff when you get new stuff when you get to that house and also she told us it's always good not to straight away decorate everywhere because that's what we, we wanted to do she was like you'll get like a vibe of the house and some of the stuff you want won't necessarily make sense once you're in and that is true because I had really wanted to go a lot deeper with colors and darker um with colors and wallpaper in this house before we moved here uh, because we've just not done that before and I wanted to try it and I thought it'd be cozy and blah 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 but then when we got here I was like it doesn't suit that like it very much suits light and pastels and a lot of cream and white like it just it just does and so yeah I'm honoring the house at the same time but look I'm so excited <laughs> I'm so excited to put it all out I'm also gonna do a autumn like decorate with me so where I'm putting everything out and making sure I, like everything makes sense and if you want to see that from me let me know my house is still a bit wild in terms of that there's boxes everywhere still this room there's just wedding stuff everywhere like you only see this little bit and it looks like nice or not like a normal house but it's crazy there's there's boxes everywhere from where we've moved in like we haven't decorated this room there's a lot of rooms we haven't decorated so it's just it just is the way it is but yeah so it's not gonna be perfect it won't be like a lot of the huge YouTubers that have like immaculate perfect houses where everything's all one shade of cream, but it will be very me. And so if you want to see that, let me know. This was something I actually like went back for. Um, when I was watching through my shop with me video, I saw a clip of this and I was like, I literally love that. Why did I not take that home? I really regret it. So when I went back, I went looking for it and they only had two and the other one was really badly marked up. So I'm really glad I got it. It is a candle. It was 7 dollars I'm not gonna burn it. Um, it looks like knitted. I love it. Even that or that, like, I'm sorry. Ah, so cute. I just, yeah, I really like that. I don't even know what it smells like. Autumn Hill candle. 
it just smells a bit spicy, a bit musty. You know, like just a gen generic autumn candle. It smells like that. So, I, I, but it's not. It's very light, like I don't think you'd necessarily notice it. It's not gonna make the room stink. And that's it for this video. My smallest home sense haul ever, I think. <laughs> but it came after a gigantic one that was probably my biggest one ever. So we've even things out, I suppose. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you did enjoy it. If you did, please do give it a like and turn your notification bell on if you are subscribed. And if you're not subscribed, please do subscribe. <laughs> that's lost all meaning now um i would love to hit 5,000 subscribers um and yeah i love making like autumn winter christmas halloween content i'm very excited this is the time when i get to come back to life after lupus has kicked my ass all summer <laughs> autumn i get to feel like a human being again so i really love baking decorating the house all that cozy goodness and if you would like to see that yeah do subscribe um, I'm going to do autumn decorate with me video, I'm going to do baking videos, but if there's anything else you would really love to see from me um, in this like autumnal cozy period um, and Halloween stuff, do let me know. Like I've done Halloween costume videos before, Halloween makeup videos before, I've done like decorate with me stuff, I've done uh, baking, um, like cozy day in vlogs. Um, I could do more shop with me's. Is there like certain shops you'd love to see me go and shop in? Whatever it is, just put it in the comments. I love making whatever you guys want to see because ultimately that's the point. <laughs> like I love making what I love, but you guys are normally always on the same page as me. So normally we all like the same stuff and you guys give me great ideas. So yeah, do let me know. I hope you're having a beautiful day wherever you are and I will see you in the next video. Bye.